Have a problem with your jeans creating that awkward muffin top? First, let's turn them inside out. With a seam ripper, you're going to rip out the seam on the crotch area of the jeans. Now, open up the area you just ripped. And using the seam ripper, open up the rear seam. Take a piece of old denim in a similar color and cut it into two pieces to expand the area. Unravel the seams and attach both sides together at the original seam. Insert a piece of the extra denim and mark the excess like this. Now, just cut where you marked. And attach the fabric pieces to the jeans using pins. Sew the pieces together Now pin both sides together Mark the excess with fabric chalk and then trim off the excess. Using a ruler, draw a line from the top right edge leading to the zero point. Cut off the excess by cutting along the line. Now, secure all the pieces together. And back to the machine to sew. Now trim off the excess and use a zigzag stitch to finish the edges. Secure the remaining parts. And so. Now, secure the final longitudinal seam. And so. Ta-da! 
time for the final result. Looks good from the inside. And from the outside. Let's try them on. Now you've got high-waisted jeans with no muffin top. Looking good from all angles. Goodbye muffin top, hello new jeans. We've all got that one pair of jeans that we can no longer button. Well, believe it or not, there's a solution. First, lay the jeans down flat and with a seam ripper, you are going to rip the waist seam. Go all the way around the waistband, pulling the threads out as you go. Now that that's done, we're going to pull off the waistband. Unzip the zipper and measure the length of the extension using your palm as a guide. Take the waistband, fold it in half the other way and cut it in half. Now measure the width of your palm from the edge of where you cut and mark it using fabric chalk. Then rip the seam of the waistband all the way up to where you marked. And cut the inner part. Do this on both sides and use the cut pieces as your extensions. Secure it using pins. And sew all three parts together. Add stretchy fabric in a similar color to the inner part of the waistband. Again, secure it using pins. and sew the outer edges together. Now tuck the excess inside and secure everything together. and back to the machine to sew. Now it's time to reattach the new waistband to the jeans. Start by pinning it back together. Now sew the waistband back on the jeans.
you can sew up the edge like this for just a little extra reinforcement. All done, a new, slightly larger waistband on your jeans. You can barely tell on the outer waistband. Now for the real test, just try them on. Ah, they fit like a glove. And look at that, you can barely tell we did anything at all.